Hi, I'm Jeff Wise of The Fan Spot, and this is NFC East Football. Hi, once again, I'm Jeff Wise and I am your host of the Fan Spot and today we're going to be doing short shots. The Eagles finished the 2011 season with a miserable 8-8 eight eight record. Why is that such a miserable record? Well, anyone that watches football will agree that the Eagles are loaded with enough talent to say that 8-8 eight eight is certainly an underachievement for a ball club that has dedicated themselves to winning football games. But what this does is it raises a question. What will 2012 bring for this team? What will be the contributing factors to their success and their failures? Well, I know some people would say, if you're loaded with enough talent, if you have a good enough team, it doesn't matter who you play, when you play, and where you play. You should be able to win football games. And that is true to a degree. But what I noticed as I went through and did some research on the NFC East, just checking out everyone's schedules, I ran across something that I think is interesting to note about what Philadelphia has to endure this coming season. Four times this season, they will be facing teams that are coming off of a bye. The Pittsburgh Steelers, week four, they have a bye. They will be facing the Eagles week five. Week five, the Detroit Lions have a bye. They're facing the Eagles week six. Week seven, it will be the Atlanta Falcons who have a bye facing the Eagles week eight, and week 10, it would be the Washington Redskins who have a bye and facing the Eagles week 11. You think that's enough? Well, this isn't to add insult to injury, but the Giants have a Thursday night game week three and they face the Eagles week four, which gives them three extra days to prepare and rest. And then later in the season, the Eagles will face the Cowboys after their Thanksgiving Day game. We all know that the Cowboys play on Thanksgiving every year, which gives them three extra days to rest for their next opponent. But guess what? The Eagles happen to play on Monday night during Thanksgiving week, which gives the Cowboys four extra days to rest. So the question is, where will the Eagles fall in the 2012 season? Will any of these things be a contributing factor to their success or failure? I love to hear your comments. Post your comments right here on the fan spot on Facebook.